Okay. If I were to ask you where do you think I was probably from, what would you say? Indian. Is that what you think? Or Mexican. Mexican, yeah. That's what I mostly get all the time. And actually... I got Indian. You got Indian? So Maybe actually, Mexican. Mexican. Yeah, I, uh, I get that a lot too. And uh, so, what, you're probably wondering what I actually am. And to be, uh, I'm not joking here, I'm actually Filipino and European. And trust me, it's been hard, you know, telling people and making them believe that I'm actually Filipino. Whenever I go to like some Filipino like restaurant or like, like Seafood City or something, you know, they don't really, they don't think I'm really, you know, Filipino, because like every time I'm with my sister or my mom, they'd be like, oh, is this your friend or is this like your uh, your cousin or something? Because like, they don't really believe I'm Filipino. I'm like, I'm Filipino. I just have bushy eyebrows and like brown ish really skin, you know, but yeah, it's hard. And uh, in this video, we're going to be showing you like the realities of what it's like to be a Filipino. And some of this might be kind of far-fetched, but most of this stuff is true, and yeah, so, ready? Ready. Okay, let's do this. Okay, number one. You know, we expect Asians to eat a lot, and you know, believe it or not, Filipinos are actually Asians. And so, you know, when they eat, they really enjoy it, and they eat a lot. And yeah, so. For example, Ainako, have you eaten some breakfast ready? Uh, not yet. Oh, you got to be a big strong boy when you grow up for your boy or girlfriend. Okay, Whichever. thank you. Thank you, mommy. Thank you. You're so nice. See yeah, you I, I had I had four. Eat your rice. I had five meals a day. Is that enough? Six. Six? Eat your rice. Uh, I think I, I should uh, get off the rice, don't you think? Yeah, you're too big. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay. Number two, uh, think about Filipinos, like, when they're on the phone, or like, some of them, there's Filipinos in America, and there's also Filipinos in the Philippines, and whenever they have their long distance calls, they really go at it, like, seriously, and, you know, you can actually understand sometimes when they're talking about you, and it gets Play really, go away! It gets really bad, uh, yeah. For example, oh my god, Jose, how you doing? Oh my god, I just went to the Philippines and I shipped like 15 clothes and and rice and Nutella and oh my gosh, my my little cousins and nieces, they're already so big. They're going to be nurses, like, like our whole family, like all Filipino people. Isn't that great, Jose? Oh, this family's becoming so big. They're gonna have their little young ones. Oh, oh, I'm so happy. So happy. Yeah. That's, yeah. Okay. Why do you say Jose? That's why I thought. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I always uh, say. Yeah, it was your, your inner Latina right there. Oh, uh, no. Okay. Number three. No, wait, wait, wait. Like, they're like always. They're always screaming, even if they're right next to each other, yeah. they can't have a conversation yeah, so just being quiet. Sometimes when I get kind of ear deaf, no joke, because my mom just goes in. You know how like you're tucking, your mom's tucking you in for bed, you say, good night, like sweetheart. My mom, it's like, good, good night, night, sweetheart. I'm like, oh my, I actually jump out of my bed sometimes and I have nightmares. And it's, and not, it's, not, it's crazy. It's, it's kind of like a workout, you know, it's like, I don't know. It's not, it's not what you think it would be. Okay, number three. Okay, so... Okay, number three. Okay, yes, Filipinos can talk very loud on the phones. And they, they might talk about their relatives, and or sometimes they might talk about people, including their children, or their husband, or wife. And, or some random or person. Some random you Hiding. think fist fights are intense? Just wait till you see mouth to mouth Filipinos. What? Yeah. Mouth to mouth? Not mouth to mouth. Face to face? Face to face? What? Oh God, it is. Okay, forget it. Number four. Number four. So, 
you know, when you're at home and you see the big TV and your parents ask you, can you put on the TV? And you're expecting like, oh yeah, put on like some HBO or like um, the Ion Television or something or whatever. But you have Filipino parents and, you know, they don't ask you to put those types of things on. They put you, tell you to put TFC or GMA or some Filipino drama on. And or wow, wow, we, ben, ben, I guess wow, wow, we. Yeah, go? good, good days. Uh, I don't know, I forgot. Uh. But yeah, so those are the good old days. But I'm serious, it's really pretty bad. And yeah, it's pretty bad. Oh, it's keeping up with the Kardashians. What do you think? Mm, no. no. Whatever you want. Okay, there is. Uh, is that? Oh, orange to the new black. Who think? do you think I am? Just go to TFC. TFC? Okay. Where's Wow Wow Wee? Wow Wow Wee is just a TFC. What's wrong with you? What? What's wrong with me? Why well, can't I watch my soap operas? Raise a horrible son. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's so hard. Uh, uh. Oh, Can no. I get the sapato? Oh no. Oh my god. Oh, huh? no. god. You get the sapato. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Oh, mommy. 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 So I hope you, you've been inspired of what you've seen today. And, um, you know, Filipino parents are actually not that bad. It's just that I'm not saying my parents are like that. I'm just saying what I've seen in movies and TV and stuff. That's. I'm saying Filipinos are awesome, not hating on them, I'm just saying that's what you can kind of expect from them sometimes, you know, when you watch them or see them in person. But they are amazing people and I love them and, you know, I'm, pr I'm proud to be a Filipino and I am Filipino by the way, if you didn't notice that. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy this and see you next time. Uh, sorry mommy, there's no wow wow we right now. That wasn't nice. Oh, yeah.